you will never know who, who, who is a sex worker. You will never know that I'm a sex worker until I tell you that I'm doing sex work because we are not labeled as sex workers. We wanted to start that to start the organization because uh, sex workers wanted to take responsibility in fighting for their rights. We experience a lot of violence, of course, from the, the police and the general public and the clients. Everyone thinks that they can just uh, violate uh, sex workers because everyone thinks they do not have the rights. Because there are also trust issues when we are working with sex workers. Even though they are the, the government uh, is trying their best to help sex workers go to the clinic and get uh, medication, it is still going to be a, a challenge for them. Because one, they, 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 they fear stigma. Secondly, some of them do not have uh, papers. <laughs> HIV infection in Botswana is certainly a health issue, but for some, it's also a labor issue. That's why we're on our way to meet the women of Sisonke, an organization that advocates for Botswana's sex workers in some of the occupational hazards that they face on the job. Today, we are moving around the city, promoting our organization and giving our clients some commodities, that's condoms and lubricants. Where we are giving our clients some condoms, we want 1999 or zero infections to our clients. We are promoting health to them. STIs be included, HIV virus, even unwanted pregnancies. That's why we are giving them some condoms for their safety. And we teach them that no sex, no condom, because their lives come first. They have to be healthy. now safe. Nowadays they report all the cases of violence to us. If you are a sex worker living with HIV, just accept yourself and love your, 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 your work because sex work is work. Just like any other work, sex work is work. So we should be very proud of our work. Mm -hmm.